simply terrifying. Very unsettling. 11 unprovoked attacks in Waltham in just a matter of weeks. Boston 25 News reporter Lisa Pappas is live outside the Waltham Police Department, where police plan on updating the public on this investigation soon. Uh, police tell us they plan on giving an update on these random attacks at 11 o'clock tomorrow morning here at the Waltham Police Department. And tonight, we're hearing from one of those victims. I feel angry because uh, I didn't expect that. This guy's a kawa because uh, he hit me for no reason. He hit me from the back. Emerson Oroche Paz has a broken nose and several stitches after a man hit him with a blunt object last week while he was walking home in Waltham. Emerson is one of 11 victims of these random, unprovoked attacks in Waltham over the last three weeks, according to police. Then I just feel a big hit from my, in my left eye. I lose the balance. I lose the balance. I tried to. I, I got. I almost got to the floor. Well, I don't. I don't get down all the way. I tried to stand up, but when I, I tried to stand up, he hit me again, one more time. Emerson says he staggered to keep his balance after he was hit from behind and didn't get to see who did this. Police released this surveillance of the suspect. They say this man has attacked several men who have been walking alone at night in various parts of the city, including downtown. Police say the suspect can be seen running away after striking his victims. I feel blessed because I'm alive. Waltham police say they're using any means necessary to try to track down this suspect. If you have any information on who this may be, you should call the Waltham Police Department. And we'll be back here at the Waltham Police Department tomorrow morning for that news conference to bring you the latest on this investigation. Live in Waltham, I'm Lisa Pappas, Boston 25 News. Lisa. Do surveillance cameras follow a person down the street? No, they don't. No, watch other guys. <laughs> There's so much bullshit.